welcome back. Foodies will know that the chai and turmeric latte have become very popular beverages in coffee shops and restaurants in recent times. We of course know these to be ancient Ayurvedic remedies passed down from many generations to keep colds and flus at bay. Today on Conscious Cooking, Anuradha prepares a traditional ginger milk and masala tea, perfect for the wintry evenings. Namaste, Vanakam, Hare Krishna, welcome to Conscious Cooking on Sadhana. I'm Anuradha and this morning I'm going to be showing you how to make two hot beverages that come from India and are perfect for the cold and chilly evenings that we're experiencing this winter. So the first drink is what we call masala chai. Chai is the Indian word for tea and masala refers to the aromatic blend of spices that we add to the chai to give it that distinctive taste. And the second drink is going to be more of a tonic really and it's great for helping with the colds and the sniffles that you experience during the cold weather. And that is milk with turmeric and a little bit of ginger. So we start with boiling some water and to the water we add black tea bags. I'm using rooibos tea bags because it's homegrown and it doesn't have caffeine so it's a very healthy choice. And to these tea bags I'm going to add a mix of whole spices. A few sticks of clove, some whole elaichi or cardamom, a good heaped teaspoon of ginger and we're going to add a nice serving of cinnamon and finally we're going to add a little bit of nutmeg and we're going to let this tea brew for a little while so that it incorporates all the spices quite nicely and you'll already at this stage be getting that lovely exotic aromatic spice smell coming out of that brew. And on this side, as the milk is boiling, we're going to add our turmeric and the additional ginger that's going to help with those colds and those sniffles that's going on. And we let that come to a boil. Right, so now that you've noticed that your water has come to a boil and all those whole spices are giving off their aromas quite nicely, we're going to add just as much milk to the beverage. So we'll just wait for the milk to heat up again. And the good part about chai that's made with homemade spices is that you can use and find these spices in your kitchen cupboard because this is what you use in your usual cooking. So you'll see that the milk has boiled and has incorporated nicely all the ginger and the turmeric. This is actually ready. So I'm going to add in some sugar in both of them just for taste and give it a mix and then we will also add in some sugar into the masala chai Sorry. and again how much of sugar you add it's up to you so I'm adding the usual two teaspoons per cup and it is now ready to put into our serving cups and we will Strain it into whatever we're going to serve it so that it is easy to drink. And you can enjoy this with something to nibble on. And there you have two exotic, warm beverages inspired in India for you to enjoy in this cool or sometimes chilly winter evenings. 